What's going on? Why am I tied up? Who are you guys? What do you want? Please, no, don't, don't come any closer. I didn't do anything, I swear, please. I really didn't do anything, and I know for sure I would never get involved with people like you. What? My, my dad? You're my dad? I didn't see him since I was eight. He doesn't even know I exist. Listen, if you're holding me hostage, I can assure you he won't come save me. Please, please, I'm, I'm telling you the truth. You're wasting your time. I don't care. It's his problem, not mine. Why am I paying for this? I'm telling you, he has nothing to do with me. Please let me go, please. <laughs> this is not fair. Yes, yes, please, just call him now. Call him. I'm telling you, he doesn't even know me. What? Tomorrow? Why not now? It's literally one call, like 10 seconds. You're busy. Okay, okay, let me talk to him. Please, I don't deserve this, please. Please, no, don't go. Don't go. Don't leave me here. No, please. Please, don't leave me here. Please. Help. Oh, my God. What? What do you mean no one can hear me? Where am I? Where the hell am I? Please, just let me go. Please. I swear to God. If your my family finds me, you're gonna be in so much trouble. Please, just let me go. No, 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 no. This is not a threat. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. It's just you're wasting your time and you're causing yourselves more problems, and you don't need that right now. I'm sure you have millions of other things to take care of. I guess I don't know. Just please, just listen to me. Just let me talk to him, like. Five seconds, please. I don't deserve this. Please. Please. What, what do you mean calm down? I can't calm down. I'm kidnapped. I'm being kidnapped. What do you mean? No. No. Please don't leave me here. Please, please. Please don't go. What are you doing here? You're staying to watch me? What can I possibly do? No one can hear me. I'm all tied up. The door is locked. Stay away. No, no, I'm not eating. So you would drug me again? Okay, you didn't, but your gang friends did. No, I don't trust anyone here. Can you please just call my dad? I'm telling you, you're wasting your time. My friends or family are definitely gonna find me. My uncle's a cop. You're just causing yourselves more problems. If you let me go now, I wouldn't say anything. I promise. I swear I wouldn't say anything. I'm serious. I would make up any excuse. Like, hey, listen, I was actually going to a party. I'll just say something like I got too drunk to get home or something. But if I go missing the whole day, they're not going to believe me and they'll start looking for me everywhere and that's when it's going to get ugly. Please, talk to your boss or whoever planned this whole thing. Please. Oh my god. What? He's your dad. Okay, then talk to him. What do you mean you can't? You're making everything complicated. Okay, 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 I'm sorry. I'll stop, I'll stop talking. Just, please, no, don't tape my mouth. Don't tape my mouth, please. Please, I'll get a panic attack and won't be able to breathe and then I'll probably just... Okay, 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 fine, fine. I won't talk. Oh my god. Oh my god, are they gonna kill me if they don't reach my dad? I need to ask him. But if I do, he'll tape my mouth. He looks really mad right now. Just give him a few minutes to calm down, then I'll ask him. Oh, this is crazy. Huh? What was that? No, no, I'm just super stressed right now. Can I ask you something? Okay, um, 
If you can't reach my dad, are you gonna kill me? You don't know? What do you mean you don't know? You never kidnapped people before? Oh, I'm the first. What a shame. Since your dad is the boss, what do you think he's gonna do? Really? You won't let that happen? What if he wants to kill me? You'll talk to him. Why would you do that? Yeah, makes sense. I don't deserve to die. Oh, so you only kill people who deserve it? Got it. Well, I'm glad to say I'm not one of those. Mm-hmm. What can I possibly do to convince you to let me go? I won't say anything. You don't believe me? Okay, a pinky promise. I can never break that. I'm serious. Still don't believe me. Since we're gonna be here for a while, how about you tell me about yourself? Okay, no names as you wish. Just anything you want to talk about. Like, how did you get in this and how did you start? Oh, uh, really? You could have said no. I mean, your dad does this, but if you don't want to be a part of it, you can just... Oh, wow, really? I'm so sorry. It must be really hard. How's it going so far? Mm hmm Okay. You're a good guy, I just... Just hope you had a choice. Yeah. Me? Well, my dad left us when I was eight. He didn't say anything. He didn't leave us anything. I just don't remember much of him. Even before he left, he, he never, he was never really around, you know, so I don't really have any memories of him. Kind of hate him because he sucked at being a dad, but I don't know him as a person. And now I hate him even more for putting me in this situation. I just hope he comes. I guess I have a small hope. How much does he owe you guys anyways? Oh my god, that's a lot of money. What is he doing? Oh, okay. Well, that sounds dangerous. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, I don't really know much of him to say like, wow, I never thought he would do that or whatever. So, I don't know. It's just, I just hate being involved in all of this, you know? I don't deserve it at all. Like, <sighs> I don't know. <laughs> I can't believe I'm just having a chill conversation with my kidnapper. Yeah, I know. But I do kind of trust you now. Mm hmm I don't know, I just feel more safe with you. You think you can escape? Sorry, I know it's not my place. I was just trying to give you ideas, I guess. Because you really don't deserve this. Yeah, of course I get it. Mm -hmm. Why do I trust you a little? Uh, I don't know, I guess just like hearing your story and just like knowing a little bit more about you just makes me feel like you're not really like them i guess so yeah what did you say you're gonna help me really you're really gonna save me please don't mess with me i'm serious say that you promise that you're going to save me oh my god you're my hero are you what why Okay, fine. I, I don't really want to know why, but yeah, let's let's do this. Yeah, of course I'll help you with that. 
<sighs> okay, you should tell them that I tried to escape, you killed me, and then got rid of the body. No, you'll be in serious trouble if you just say I escaped. They won't trust you anymore, and God knows what they would do to you. Have you ever got rid of bodies before? That's your job? Perfect. They won't even suspect anything about that because that's what you do. You never killed. Just tell them you really had to, like... They would trust you even more. I'm serious. This is gonna help both of us. The sooner this happens, the better. And again, you don't have to worry about me telling anyone. I already have my excuse ready. You need what? Blood? Oh, um, I mean, sure, yeah. I'll give you my blood. Um, just cut here. And do it fast, please. Uh, uh, okay, okay. Yeah, 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 it hurts. It hurts like hell. Okay, take it. Oh my god, it's bleeding a lot. Just just take it, just take it. Your hands, your shirt, everywhere, just everywhere. Oh my god, that's a lot of blood. Yes, 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 that's perfect, that's perfect. Okay, now do you have something I can wrap it with? Please, to stop the bleeding. Yeah, yeah, that would work, that, that would work, that's perfect. Uh, tighter, tighter, please, tighter. Okay. All right. Oh my god, it burns. It burns so much. <laughs> oh wow, look at you. Look at all the blood you got. Okay, what now? What? They're coming in 15 minutes? You've got to be kidding me. What are you looking at? Let's go. Can you please drive me somewhere closer to my house or like literally right next to my door? That way you could put more blood in the car, I guess. And also, if they see me running in the street, that's going to be horrible for both of us. So, yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> Let's go. We're really doing this, aren't we? I wish you would have your chance one day to escape. I don't know, I just have this... Um, this feeling that it's gonna get better for you just because you helped me. <laughs> I know it's weird and I, I know we just met, but... I don't know, I have a strong feeling that things are gonna get better for you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what do you want to do after all this? Really? That's your passion? Now that's really cool, I love it. You wanna talk about it a bit more? Yeah, I mean, it's a long road, so. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> no, it's not nerdy at all, it's, it's amazing. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, you're gonna be able to do that yeah this is so weird like I'm totally trusting you and having a conversation with you this whole time and I don't even know what you look like or your name or anything like that no I'm, I'm not asking you to reveal anything I'm just I'm just saying I never really experienced that before you know mm -hmm. okay yeah this is me Thank you so, so much for doing this. I'll never forget it. I wish I could give you something in return. I honestly don't know what, to, what I can give you for saving my life, but just my silence. Yeah, of course, you got it. Do I look alright? Do I look like I went to a wild party and got drunk and here I am? <laughs> 
Okay, thank you. Thank you so much. I hope everything gets better for you. Thanks again. For everything. For making me feel safe. For keeping me company. And most importantly, for saving my life. I really want to hug you right now, but the blood and this, yeah. <laughs> it's a little too much. <laughs> Alright, thank you. I gotta go. You're a good guy. Don't ever forget that. <laughs> Thank you. Take care. Bye.